hope you are managing him like a dose so guys whenever you see me wear this cap especially in us you know i'm coming to fight war uh so guys please put your hand and share this is very important i don't know why as you said we are christians and you'll be fighting your opposite your christian body i've never seen another religion like that today evangelist Ebukobi came to expose straight ahead some pastors and churches priests that have been stopping their members of coming to zion and stop their members of wearing zion articles like zion clothes zion bango zion um, um, uh, anything that has to do with zion they are stopping their members of not bringing it to their churches uh, i want you to listen to what evangelism book will be said on it after that i will come and also expose the one that happened here in us yes don't worry let's watch it i heard that there is one place they told you people you should not come with bango correct you should not come with um one of the um, church they say don't come with zion bango yes don't wear polo zion come correct but the same church does not want those that come with the celebrities bango uh, there are people that wear some polo of some celebrities they don't stop them it's those be. that wear zion bango they stop they them stop them but it is very unfortunate that they will end up pursuing their member. Now, so, always you. Uh -huh. Because happened? there are church everywhere. There are church everywhere. Anybody, they say, don't come. We go to the nearest parish. Simple. Amen and amen. Amen. That's, that's father want to lose his members. Amen and amen. Amen. It's a pity. What you're supposed to be telling people is about Jesus Christ. Not don't wear this. Don't wear that. That person, you that are going with the bango, are you a kid? They should also tell some people, don't go to native doctor. Don't go to herbalist. Because some people who go to church, some churches still go to visit native doctor. They should open mouth and say, those who go to church, don't go and join secret court. Because some members of the church are members of secret court. That is what they will be saying. Some people sponsoring the, some churches are members of all God. That is where the men of God is supposed to concentrate. You that are donating money in the church, are you a member of secret court? Not don't wear bango, as I am bango. Is that one is old story. If you wear Zion Bango. And somebody said you will not come inside the church. Are you hearing me? Yes, sir. Quote me right. Are you learning anything bad here? Since you are coming here, are you not seeing the miracle of God? Yes, sir. Uh -huh. So, since you are coming here, have you learned anything bad? Huh? So, any church you go, they say, don't wear this polo. Leave that church. Go to another place. Am I speaking to somebody here? Yes, sir. I don't know where one church there. me of man. Every Sunday, the church will, will, will not give announcement of members who are members of Secret Court. Stop coming to. Stop receiving communion because some members that receive some communion in some Pentecostals or total church, some of the members that first receive communion, some of them are members of secret court. That is what the church is supposed to be preaching. Every time we carry charm here, most boys bringing charm are they not going to one church. That is what the church is supposed to be preaching. It's not those that we are bang, don't come. You will end up emptying your church. Because nobody can leave Zion because of any reason. Two of us. Amen and amen. Amen. When you see a man of God who does not know what to preach, 
they started preaching Ebukobi. Anytime you see Zion, Ebukobi, that person don't know what to preach. This message will go to them. Coming Sunday, let them still announce it. They will see that those people will begin to drop. Very soon, basket offering will begin to suffer. And when you begin to suffer, you will know that you are pushing Zionites away. 2017, there was one of our members that went to one church here. The man of God there said, if you wear this bangle, I will not listen to your um, confession or give you communion. The man of God said, the brother said to him, to be honest, man of God, to be honest, I was not a Catholic. I was born a Sabbatarian. And I am still a member of Sabbath. The day I came to Zion, Brother Buka preached about Mother Mary. And encouraged us to go to our parish. That was when I came here. And I was one of them that baptized last month. Telling me to leave Zion is for what? I will not do it. Mm. And the second thing, another boy from Apostle of Christ. This one is Apostle of Christ. That one also went. They tell him, eh, eh, where are you going to Zion? That boy brought his leg. That his leg was the whole hospital confirmed that they will cut off the leg until he comes to Zion. And this brother prayed for him. The leg, even the Bob said they will cut it. And the, after he, he prayed, the leg was healed. Anybody telling me to stop going to Zion is is an uh, antichrist. The brother was saying this in presence of that father. Stand up wherever you are. Leave that hand up. somebody's hand. Will <laughs> voilà. don't, uh, don't, don't come with the bangle don't come with the father but the same people wear one club bangle he didn't tell them not to wear that one don't mind them enough of that rubbish better one always yoku always yoku always that is Bafa. Talk all names. Santi. <laughs> Santi. <laughs> <laughs> Lift your hand up. May the Lord bless you. This Amen. month is our month. Amen. 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 Lift that hand and shout it. This month is our month. Evangelist Ebuko B did not actually want to call names. You know, we, we hardly, they don't call names in Zion. All right. But the thing is, why are you stopping your members of wearing Zion articles? Does it make sense? Zion is not dragging with you. It's not fighting anything with you. Zion is not... You have not told anybody not to go to church. You have not told anybody not to go to um, um, parish. Because Zion is a prayer ground. It's not a church. So you are stopping your members... I don't know why, why those people will still be going to that church or that priest. Because if actually you claim you are a Christian, you will know a connection that has to do with your own blood lineage. Have you seen any other religion fighting or stopping other people of going to other places to pray? Mba. It is only in Christianity you find it. Now, you know, people who will be keeping quiet doesn't mean we don't know what to say. Similar thing happened to, I want to tell you guys what happened to a priest in here, here in the US. I'm not fighting any priest. And if you want me to come and prove it and, and, and 
and um, I, we, I have every evidence to show you. Now, and that priest also has school in Agor right now. I will give you facts. That priest has school in Agor. I will give you facts. Don't, I know what I'm saying. Because of I don't want to call names. Now, this same priest have come on air to not start talking good about Evangelist Bukobi. Hold on. This priest was in Nigeria. So, this priest will watch this video and know what I'm talking about. When he was in Nigeria, there was a sister in, um, um, in Texas that loved what this priest was doing and told this priest, why can't you come to the U.S. to at least have a prayer grant, a place of prayer? She will organize, she will meet one or two people, she will have a connection of making it happen. Now, that sister, she's a medical practitioner, met a couple of people and they, okay, they transport, they help this man, this priest, to come down to the U.S. They accommodated him. The sister that have children, this sister have eight children. They accommodated this priest. They raised funds for this priest. This priest, they gave this priest wings, open an account. Even his a Facebook account was opened for him by this sister. Mr. Priest, true of us. I don't want to call your name. Doesn't mean I don't have facts. I have your I have everything. It didn't end there. Now, after they started gathering, they did a WhatsApp group. People started coming in, tripping in. You know, we love Catholic. So when it comes to Catholic priests, we love them. I love priests. Now, this priest now start telling his members to stop going to Zion. And everybody that have helped you come here and organize things for you are all Zionites. 95% of them. How can you stop telling them to stop going to Zion? That is how that priest started losing members here. That sister that helped him, the sister was advising him on how what he should do. He thought the sister was commanding him. You know, Nigerian men are authorization. The sister left, others started leaving because of he was stopping them. He lose members. Uh, he lose, the priest know him. The priest know himself. And most of you people that are in Cali in Texas know this priest. I don't want to call him. Please, I don't know why you will be stopping. If you want me to come and prove it to you, I have it. Don't worry yourself. I will, will, will make call now. Don't worry yourself. I know what I'm telling you, but I did not mention name. Uh, I did not mention name. I don't know the kind of body you say we are. You are stopping your members, finding every means to stop them going to Zion. Any body that is a, any body, any pastor, Christian body that told you to stop going to where you pray, leave that place, look for another church. Lived anybody. See, Zion is not the only prayer ground. They have other prayer ground, prayer ministries. I'm telling you, if anybody, pastor, anybody, tell you to stop going to where you are going for prayer ground, when you know you are getting solution, stop going to that place. Except it's not for good. Except that place you are going is not good. It's fine. But I'm using my own Zion prayer movement attribute. If anybody stop you, stop going to that church. Yes. Thank you very much for watching. I know you will not like this video. Share. Uh, please. I love priests. I'm a proud Catholic. I love the Christendom. Uh -huh. I love them. But anyone that is going out of the core, God call him. Or the core, the, the mother call him, or the father call him. Please, with all due respect, should retract back that call. Stay your lane. Respect your call. Identify your call and we will help you achieve it. Because you need us like we need you, sir. God bless you with no harm. I apologize to anybody that feel offended with this video. Yes. My bishop, my pope, priest, anybody, pastors, you get offended. I'm sorry, but the truth needs to be told. Thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.